Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Desiree Marie. Welcome to all of you that are... Are you serious? Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Desiree Marie and today I want to do a review of a few products that I have been using as of lately and that is the Jamaican Mango and Lime um, product line. I know that this is a tried and true brand. A lot of people have been using it. Um, I used this a, a few years ago actually for the first time and I had a certain way that I kind of looked at it back then and decided not to use it again but I decided also to try it again seeing that um, they're still on the shelves they do have a new look to them and I just needed a little something in my routine I was a little bored of the same products that I was using in my hair so I just decided to pick these up and try it again and so today I just want to come with a review um, just giving my personal opinion about these products do they work you know what 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 I like about them um, some of the pros and cons and how my hair has been acting since using them okay so starting with the shampoo so the tangle shampoo includes moringa seed oil manuka honey and it's supposed to invigorate the scalp gently cleanse the scalp and also remove product buildup from the scalp um, this is for all hair types really and truly natural locks twists this shampoo does not have parabens in it um, it gently cleanses while binding and sealing in moisture on hair and scalp and it helps protect scalp from dryness and flaking um, you can use this if you have braids for a healthier and softer than before feel so would I recommend this product yes I would I really enjoyed it I do believe that it is a good formula especially if you have like a lot of itchiness dryness maybe even dandruff I don't know I if I had dandruff I would use this and um, I believe that it would give me that soothing feeling on my scalp at least to relieve me of the itchiness and the just excessive irritation that I felt before so I love this product I would definitely recommend if you want this product if you want to include this product in your wash day routine I will link this down below as well as the other product that I'm about to talk about but this will be a staple especially when I do feel the itchiness in my scalp and so forth which I do feel from time to time Okay, so the retwisting gel. I saw this and remember the last time that I used it. Um, it was it had a different look to it, and the formula inside also looks different. This formula has a clear color and a very loose consistency, um, the same consistency that it had before. Um, the last time I used. The retwisting gel it was kind of like a pinkish orange like a peach color but I see that they have since changed the color you can correct me if I'm wrong but um, when I when I purchased this and I, I took it home I felt how very loose the consistency was and instantly kind of felt disappointed feeling like okay this is not gonna work like how can something so thin and just kind of it, it's not thick so how can that truly help hold my retwist because the whole purpose of me purchasing this was so that I could get a product so that I can use a product that will help me to hold my retwist a little bit longer um, because it claims to be great for difficult to lock hair and give it an extra hold so I was a little disappointed when I felt the consistency however it works <laughs> it, it I feel like the consistency makes it so that it's easier for you to retwist your roots without all the nasty you know clumping and and, and thick products in your hands this helps to kind of ease the process throughout the entire head and it sticks it keeps your hair from unraveling 
So if you're dealing with unraveling of the roots, this is good for you. I wish that I had used this when I was pregnant and my roots were not locking like I wanted them to. Um, this would have probably held my roots a little bit longer than what we saw that it did, which was like few days tops. I, I, I felt like I had that nice crisp retwisting feel. Um, it did not load down my hair with gook. It, it's a very thin product and I only use just a little bit. Since I know that my hair is prone to build up, I only use just a little bit. And if you, whether or not you think that your hair is prone to build up, I would only use a little bit. Like a little bit truly goes a long way with this product as well. Um, I used it only one time and I don't, I don't really need to use it until my next retwisting session, which will probably be, you know, another maybe two, three weeks after I initially retwisted. Right now I am due a retwist. This is about maybe three weeks after using this. Um, and I can see that my hair has held up a lot throughout maybe the back area on um, the front here. I've been doing a little bit of tugging, you know, ponytail wearing, so it's not as together as, you know, as maybe I would think that it should be, but who ha who still has a retwist after three weeks post retwist? So there's not really much to say um, besides I like this product. Um, my hair only needs just a little bit and after say retwisting my hair and then taking out the clips three hours later I had a nice clean retwist and that retwist was clean and fresh for two weeks top. Out of ten I would say I would rate it a nine. <laughs> it doesn't take much to please me. I love this product. Um, I have used some really sucky products that did not do much for my retwist. Like I tried to once um, make my own flaxseed gel and that didn't really hold that well. Plus it like molded shortly after. I didn't really know what I was doing. I even tried to make a an aloe vera gel which that didn't do much either. It didn't give me the hold that I needed. And I had used Eco Styler gel years ago that didn't do much either but when I tried this it definitely did hold up um, the last time that I used this years ago I combined this with the grease that I was using which was the nature's blessings grease I felt like the two the combination of the two really gave me that nice moisturized roots look <laughs> if that makes sense so I definitely do love this product I love both products. I feel that, I mean, there, there's no, there's nothing to complain about. I really wish, I, <clears throat> I really wish that um, there weren't so many ingredients in the bag. Like, I, I don't know. I don't know much about what to look out for other than um, paraben. But I, I, I would... I would feel more safe if the product didn't have as many ingredients, <laughs> but this one has quite a few um, and I don't know all that there is to know about these product, these ingredients, so in that I know I, 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 I have to use it very loosely, um, but it works. <laughs> in the past, I kind of had different thoughts about what my hair routine should look like but now that I'm not in the realm of being super natural when it comes to my hair care routine and I am open to store products that have different types of ingredients included I'm open to this brand again so I love this duo I will link this down below if you are interested in trying it yourself um, yeah and I think the two of these together cost me a little under $20 but it is well worth it because with the shampoo I know that I will have this for the next the next six months because I wash my hair maybe every two to three weeks now this locking gel this is going to last me for the next year two years because I'm not gonna be using this a whole lot every time I wash my hair and I don't retwist every time I wash so this may last me for a couple of years and that's well worth the price that I paid for this, which was about $8. Okay, so this is week three of um, 
my retwist. As you can see, there really is nothing to see around the edges. But if I invite you into the other parts of my hair, it's not super clean as I know that it wouldn't be at this point. Okay, so there you have it. That is what I feel about the Jamaican Mango and Lime um, product line, their new look and their new formula. Um, let me know in the comments down below if you have tried this yet. I know that this is not a brand new product line. This has been around for a long time, so I'm kind of, you know, late to the party. But let me know if you have tried this before and what you think about it. What do you rate it? Out of 1 to 10, what do you rate this and why? Let us know down below in the comment section. And like I said, I will link this in my description box in case you want to purchase yourself. Um, yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching this video. Um, like I said, join us down below so that we can continue the conversation about Jamaican Mango and Lime product line. And I'll see you in the next video, which will be a wash day routine because, girl, I need it. <laughs> I need it. So you guys will see that video coming up next after this one. So make sure that you're subscribed, and I'll see you later. Bye.